Hello, dears. Uh, welcome back to the tutorials on the SolidWorks. Uh, today we will continue with our the sketch techniques environment. So uh, we will start to see the uh, new sketch, which is the circle. Today we will discuss the all options how to create the circle. So in order to do this, uh, let's open the new file. The, we will work on the part environment. So press OK. Let's press OK. And you will be directed to the, the, or the part environment. So in the previous lessons, uh, we just discussed about the interface of the SOLIDWORKS. And uh, we discussed about the uh, sketch techniques, uh, started to analyze the line. So the next is the circle. So uh, here, if you open the circle, uh, we have the two options to create the circle. The circle uh, by the uh, center and the, the radius and the, by the three points. So uh, the most used one is the circle by the center is the most used. So uh, in order to do the uh, sketch the circle, as usual that you have to select the plane here the, in the part navigator we discussed at the three planes the front plane top plane and the right plane so uh, with the, any project when you start uh, when you start that uh, with your project you have to select the plane for example that uh, in this case i would like to select the, for example the front plane select the front plane the the left uh, left uh, left click the mouse and here the select the sketch now uh, you will be directed to your the, uh, plane. So it is the automatically will be the directed. So now I will select here the for the beginning, the circle, the first option by the center. Then if you select uh, your the circle, uh, if you see here, you will uh, direct it to, the, to create circle directly with the two options, the two cycle, two circle type that's uh, by the center and by three points. So uh, now we will uh, draw the circle in the first option. Here also you have the options. So you, there is several options. For example, you can directly add the dimension while they're creating the circle or you can create uh, your circle according to the diameter or the radius. In this case, uh, the, let's uh, uh, disactivate this one also and see the uh, this option. In this case, uh, we should disactivate uh, this uh, diameter dimension. It means that you will create your the circle according to the uh, according to the radius. So, uh, so we will see the all the options here in the parameters. You will see the the positions of your the circle according to the x and y points and it is the radius so while you create uh, the circle this position will be the change it so for example let's uh, select this one again so it is selected and you see you can create the circle to the any point so for example you can create directly on the y-axis so this line is created here or directly to the uh, y axis, you see the, the sign is created, or you can create to the origin. So let's start to create the circle at the origin. Press uh, your mouse, and you see it shows it is the dimensions and the uh, it is the shows it is the radius in this case because our the dimension activation is uh, activated. And press your mouse again. Here you see the circle is created, and you can create uh, this here the. The circle is still active and you can create the circle to the any point by just clicking your the mouse and the dragging and the clicking again your the mouse you see the circle by the center is the creating now uh, you can uh, finish and uh, by clicking this icon so your the circle is created if you would like to create the circle again just click again the, this icon and here you can make, for example, add dimension, activate the add dimension first option. Let's see. And in this case, if you create the, uh, if you create the circle, you see the dimension is the, here the showing. Let's say here the define for the beginning the the unit. So here again, and in this case, you see the dimension is the showing because the, here let's close it. 
and uh, again open the circle we are activated here the our the dimension option so in this case the dimension will be represented so in this case let's uh, again the here if you activate the, the di diameter and if you draw here the here it shows here the diameter in this case uh, we draw here the without activation of diameter it shows uh, it is the radius here uh, hence we activated it is the the di diameter dimension it shows here for us the the, the diameter since here the, the diameter dimension is activated so on you can create any circle like this so here the same the diameter if i disactivate here the diameter and i draw here the circle you see it shows here the only the radius so yeah, the same way you can create the circle the as you want and here uh, we have also the one option is created it is uh, called for the construction if i activate uh, this is the for the construction if i draw the uh, circle so in this case you see that the circle will become it is the border in the dash line it means it is the for the uh, for the construction it is not the uh, the blue one like this so it is just a real helping line as a helping circle so this is the option of the creating the circle so uh, with the several options you can add the dimension you can create the circle with the diameter or the circle and one more thing that we have to also to discuss here if i draw the, my circle here in the lower part in the parameters it shows that it is the coordinate according to the x and y in this case, according to the X, is uh, negative here. This is our the red one is our the origin, so it is the negative along the X and it's positive along the Y axis. It is an upward direction and it represents here the radius as well. So radius is also the represented here. In the next lessons, we will see how to the, add the dimension for the our the sketch and so on. This is just the first option how to create the circle. So with the center now let's see the uh, second option how to create the circle it is the perimeter circle so with the three points so select this one so it is that directly selected here or if you select uh, for example this one and uh, you can switch your the option to the this one in this uh, menu so in this case we have only the option which is uh, for the construction option in this case and uh, uh, the same we have the parameters that is the location along the x and y and as well as it is the red so let's start to create those so first point is created and you will start to uh, move your the mouse so second point you will select it to see uh, second point is selected and you can create by the third point so here the circle is created but my circle sketch is still active and the same way here you can create uh, the, this circle for the construction by activating this option so this is uh, the represents what i explained is the parameter that is the location it means the this center point location of the, this circle along the x and along the y and it is the radius as well so here you can make it for the construction so it will become the construction line and you can uh, directly it's, uh, disactivate this one and it will become again the active line active circle so close this one so it will become the this circle so this is the the second option how to create the circle that unfortunately in the this type of circle we couldn't make the options like the show the dimensions and the uh, and that's so on so what we have done in the first option so this is the the, the second option so let's see again here first point you can uh, move your the mouse and second point define and you can define the here uh, like this or in the here the third, third point of the your the mouse so in this case let's create uh, this circle for the construction activate the option for the construction and press this icon so here in this case the circle is created for the construction so uh, dear friends the dear subscribers that is the brief the introduction the, about uh, how to create the sketch uh, the circle and the, in the sketch environment so uh,
they follow our the channel and we will see the other sketches and the advanced levels of the other options in the solve works in the near future.